Kitty and welcome back to Franville. This is episode 12. I finally remember what episode it is. We're gonna see the puppet show or whatever this is. So anyway, I think I'd like to call it a puppet show. So yeah, um, I'm excited to do this. Oh, it's a movie. In a world made of darkness and light. Two little sisters try to steal each other's charm. But none of the sides could decide. If what they were was just right. Ooh. Mia was angry and Clara was sad. Oh my god, these are the, like the twins, the conjoined ones. And this was because they both were mad. Oh, insane little girls. Just like us. <clears throat> Inside of their minds. It would, the creature of the night. He came always round in dreams or reality, teaching the girls the splendor of duality. But they couldn't understand. Itward was a friend. Itward was the link between darkness and light. He was grey. But Clara and Mia one day decided no to get rid of Itward once and for all. Die, creature of the night, die, they said. But they killed each other instead. Dead and gone, the sisters kept complaining about each other. It's all your fault, Clara. It's all your fault, Mia. Then Itward came to visit for the last time. And he said, You are both trapped. Ooh. In the world of disconnections. <laughs> Sounds cool. But I'll give you a chance. Wasn't Itward dead? No. The world has been mean to you. They sewed your bodies together. Owie. To prove that they could. They gave you a mirror to compare yourselves. I'll give you nothing but what you already have. And just one tiny little chance to understand the purpose of life. But the clock is ticking. You have until the day a black cat goes missing. Oh my god. It's midnight. And the world's magic door is unlocked. That's us, guys. The end. That was pretty, pretty cool, actually. Ooh. The flying machine is incredible. It can fly. Okay, so... Can we touch anything here? Ooh. Feet! One foot with a shoe. One foot without a shoe. A wooden foot. It reminds me of me when I was a tree. Hammer, obviously, to hammer stuff. Oh, cool. We can get that. I think now this is the room we're supposed to go in. Oh, hi, Mr. Midnight little guy thing. I actually want to see if anything is... <gasps> Holy guacamole! Seconds and minutes and hours and days. Tick, tock, tick, tock. I forget to understand you. I forgot to give myself some love. Eyeball there. And this eyeball. Oh, right, that's not an eyeball. I'm guessing we have to collect these things. I don't see many arts around and they're creeping me out. Ooh, what's that? Let me see. Hmm. AFM? Missing. What do you have inside, little bottle? Oh, okay, that's cool. I think we have to use the tubes here because that's what it looks like. Uh, so... Okay, let's use it here. Okay, let's use this here. No, let's use this here. No, let's use that there. Yeah, then let's use that there. Oh, cool. Then let's use this there. Yay. Then let's use here. Yes, okay. Awesome. Awesome source. And I don't know, like, how we install. Oh, what's this? 
Oh, I guess you can drag it. That's cool. I guess he said the posters in the world should help. Okay, so this, let's try and get this puzzle solved first. Okay. Match. That goes that way. Okay. That seems to be... I think it said it had to be like that. And that had to be there. And that had to go to the side. That's a leaky thing, I guess. So, we can put the water here. But won't that damage the electricity? So we use that. I should give myself a hug from being so clever. So is there any... Oh, I guess we can collect some more water. Cool. And then I guess we can take that back up. And we still have a matches from the sister's house. Oh, we did that one. That's cool. Uh, now let's try and do this. Okay. AFM. Is an AFM missing? 8, okay, 8.18, 2pf, R15, so, 8.18, um, 2pf, R15, and then, wasn't there, N166, so, there, reality view, Unreality view. Bye, berries. AFM! Okay. That looks cool. So it seems like we've gotten the fire berries, and I think they should be turned on in order to work. Matches. Matches. Boom. Awesome sauce. I think we have to cross this off. Boom. Just awesome. Okay, so let's really quickly, like, make sure this is. No, damn it. I'm pretty sure this is. No! Um. Oh, right. I'm pretty sure it had something to do with those switches. Blue, red. Okay, got it. So. Blue that way, red that way. I think it's done! Super Chemistry Master Prambo! Boom, girl, you did it. We solved it. Fan, I finally managed to fix the automatic driver. Do you need help? I think I managed myself quite well, too. I did all you asked of me. Very well, Fran. Everything seems to be working perfectly. Yes, everything looks absolutely great. What should we do now, sir? Well, I wanted to ask you if you were afraid of rabbits. There is a little rabbit in one of the rooms, and I'm... I'm deeply afraid of it. Would you like to let me... Would you like to get me rid of it? Would you like to help me get rid of it? A rabbit? I guess it depends on the rabbit, sir. With all the things I've seen, I can't just imagine one kind of rabbit. Is it a chocolate rabbit? Or one with horns and killer eyes? You'll have to see it for yourself. It ha has a pink nose and blue boots. It's just sitting there. No blinking, no movement. It's staring all the time. It does sound very scary, sir. But show it to me, otherwise I will never know. Brave you are, dear. Follow me now. Okay, that's cool. But, like, what's this, though? Wow, it's a huge spinning top. We never, like, got to explore this. Oh, the compass goes in circles, upside down and nowhere. Cool. Oh, I guess we're gonna go here. Oh my god, is this the room? This is the room that was locked and, like, we were really curious about. There, see? It's just sitting there. Isn't that a strange behavior? Um. From what I see, it's just a toy, sir. It won't move. Would you please try and make contact? Oh, there it is. Oh, right. Contact with it. All right, sir. I'll take the rabbit and show you there's nothing to be afraid of. Okay, then. He looks horrified. Like, <gasps> See, it's just a fluffy rabbit. Nothing to be afraid of. Oh, you're right, Fran. There is nothing to be afraid of. Is he petting Mr. Midnight? What? No. What? Don't go, Mr. Midnight. This is not funny. Guys, guys, it was evil. Oh, no. Cool. <laughs> I saw a button and I pressed it.
um, let's press things then. Ugh, oh, it won't turn on. What should I do? I don't know. Just click everything, friend. Nuts and bolts. I never know which is which. Ah! Then we have to open it up from what I see. Um. Oh, I get it. This is easy. Whee! Okay, done. Something's missing here. It looks like a battery because it's got like signs. And just in luck, we got the battery. There you go. Battery place. Yes, it works. I guess we can like switch this now. Oh, so that switches something. What does it press? No, actually, I don't want to press that yet in case it like takes me into oblivion. <laughs> um, happy pills. Oh, the numbers have changed. I can't help but feel like the numbers are important. I'm going to, like, jot down all the numbers and I'll be right back. Okay. I jotted them down. Oh. But what does that button press? I think it presses this one. <gasps> okay. That's cool. That's cool. What the hell is this? Mommy? But I had the pills closed. Are you? <gasps> Holy crap! Mommy? Daddy? Who did this to you? Oh my god, no, I can't. Just no. I had the pills off, guys. Hmm, this is locked. I've seen these in movies. The feet always knows what to do. Okay, that's cool. Okay. Okay. But, like, I think the number cards is, like, what we're supposed to do here. So, um, I think it had to do with those cards because there's no way, like, what's that? A reset button. How practical. I guess we just, like, okay. Okay. Um, so that's, um, one, two... So that's, uh, I don't know how this could be. I'm going to try two ways. Eight, then maybe one, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Then nine. Oh. <laughs> Okay. No, it's locked. Okay. Let's try it a different way. Um one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five. Four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. No. Huh. Oh my god, it's open! Haha, <laughs> we're awesome. Why is the lights off? Oh, that's what the locked door is at the top. Hmm. I don't see very well, it's quite dark. <gasps> oh my god! Surprise, Fran! Happy birthday! Oh my god! I guess she's 11 now, guys! She's 11! Happy birthday, Fran! Happy birthday, Fran! Oh, a birthday party! Whoa, I thought you wanted to kill Mr. Midnight! You lied to me! We lie to you in order to keep your attention in another direction. I'm very sorry I had to fool you, my friend. He wanted to surprise you, my dear Fran. Come and eat cake. Yes, please. All right. Thank you, Kitty. You really surprised me. Thank you, it would, sir. Oh, is that the key? The like the sister. The cake is made of all ingredients you like. Mister Midnight told me which one. This. Cat. I need to buy this cat. Where do you buy this cat? I need him. <laughs> the little tree in the background. Hee <laughs> hee. Looks like the speech bubble's coming from him. And we have something very special for you from all the members of the ship. 
That means all of us naturally born are handmade things. Here you go. Hope you find it educational. Oh, it looks like it's got ears. Wow, I love the wrapping. Can I open it now, please? Yes, go ahead, open it. Okay, let's examine. Oh, it's a Mr. Midnight toy. <gasps> wow, a cat doll. Oh, thank you so much. I love it. It's beautiful. It may give your eyes a new perception, you know, like the ultra reality. Is that what happens when I take the red pill, sir? The ultra reality? What I see? Well, it depends. Would you like some explanation? Yes, please. Oh, wow. I'm a mind reader. Look, what you've seen is a mixture of different realities. And the ultra reality is like an invisible room where everything exists at the same time. For example, at this exact coordinate of time and space, we're having a birthday party. But in the ultra reality, other things are having are happening all the time. Slower, faster, or just invisible to the human eye. It's because of time humans can define past, present, and future. Defining things encapsulates reality and gives humans a chance to understand their environment. You have a different perception of the environment. It's not linked to definitions. Do you understand what I say? I'm not sure, sir. I think maybe I feel a bit dizzy. <laughs> the ship. That may be the ship going up and down. Blow on the candles now, dear. We're about to reach our destination. Yes. Blow out the candles. You mean we're about to get home? Did you hear that, Kitty? Yes, we're about to arrive. Really? Wow, how exciting! Oh. I bet you the lights are gonna go off. Because that's like classic horror movie, and this game's so twisted. <laughs> but I love it! <sighs> what? I told you guys! It always happens in horror movies. Oh no. Oh no. Oh! No! No, no, no! Hello? I need explaining here. Oh dear, what's happening? Mr. Midnight, are you alright? I'm alright, but I hope the ship won't break. It sounds dangerous. It would just magically appears. Fran, you have to help. I have to drive the machine again. The automatic driver was destroyed by the Kamalas. The water did nothing. There is one left alive. You have to get rid of it. Find it fast. How do you do how do I do that, sir? Water, that cleans the dirt. Hurry up now. Remember, it may be hiding from your eyes. Oh my goodness, Kitty, I'm scared. Me too, my Fran. We have to find the Kamala. I really hope the water destroys it. Let's go. Okay, let's go. Oh my god. I'm horrified of clowns. I, why did I know it? He said, um, uh, be careful because, like, it might be invisible to our eyes. I was like, fine. Boom. Thumbnail. Thumbnail. Oh god. It's dying. No, it went upstairs. Ah, oh, don't run away. Where are you going? I guess it's gone upstairs. Oh god. I hate clowns. Okay. I know where it's going. There we go. We hit this thing with water. Bam. Nope. It's stubborn. No. Bam. Blood. Ew. It's stubborn. Bam. Three times, guys. Three times. Yeah. I think if I finally got rid of the Kamala, I'm the best. I should go. But actually, guys, I'm actually going to end the episode right here so um anyway thanks for watching guys please like comment subscribe do all that please um please subscribe because it's free and comment down below what other series as you think i should be doing like after i finish this um like also show me what you think about this series i don't buy it um and i've also got like um for my really really like 
one of my best, best friends, Charlie, who really likes the series, Charlie Bear, um, yeah, that's like her nickname, anyway, well, she really, really likes the series, and she's gonna help me, like, decide on the next one, so thank you for being such a big help, you are awesome, I swear to God, and you are awesome, I'm not even joking, um, so anyway, guys, thanks for watching, and remember, Kitty loves you.